Hey there. So uh, to answer the question on sends and returns within the drum rack, thought I would uh, make a quick video and hopefully it helps. So if we come over here to uh, the sends and returns here, you see these buttons are off. You're simply going to turn these on and then you're going to drop your effects over here. So let's just drop in a uh, reverb or something like that. No big deal. All right, and now as you can see, that created one return, right? So I can click on that. I've got the reverb. I can add more effects to that particular return. And if I want to have, let's say, a delay, I just drop it in here. And now I have uh, two sends, right? So now what you see, let's just say that slice one here is our kick drum uh, that you use in your uh, section. Now here we go. We're able to just turn up that send here and it leaves all the other slices alone unless you turn them up on those uh, different ones. So that is how you control sends and returns. Uh, on single slices inside of uh, drum racks. So I hope that helps. Peace.